Hey guys, welcome back. So yes, today we are going to do a DIY um, home water filtration system that you can do for real cheap. So let's get to it. Okay, so to start this filtration system, the things you will need, <clears throat> and I got this off of Amazon. I will leave the link down below for you. This is a dome filter. Now this dome filter, according to your water condition, after a month, I just would clean it around the dome. But this will filter um, a thousand gallons. So that's not bad for a small system at home. You probably won't even use that much if, you know, I mean, around here, they do um, hydrant cleaning, hydrant flushing a lot. So once that happens, they put up warnings and we get brown water and we can't use the water then for you know a few hours or something. So I can use this for that. So what you need is that dome system. It comes with two dome filters and two spigots. So you can do two different ones or keep the filter for one system and just go on that way. And you will need this pot. This is uh, actually, I got this out of Walmart. It comes with lids, but lids are over there. You know what the lids look like. Uh, you need two of these. These are, you can use any any size. I got the eight quart size, two eight quarts. Um, you will need a drill bit like that, multi-hole drill bit. I drilled the holes already. Didn't think you really needed to see that, so you know how to drill, I'm sure. So the first one was you drill a hole in the bottom. And then the next one, you drill a hole on the side. So what we're going to do is you put the, the uh, dome in like this inside. Then you have this little, like, lug nut. And you put it on the end. Cinch it down tight so there'll be no leaks. And that's in there. Let me shut this light off for a second. And it sits in there. There you go. Then the spigot, you just put in the hole, obviously. And here's a little lug nut. Now, when you're drilling this hole, make sure you leave enough room so you can tighten this down and it does come with some rubber washer so it doesn't leak it takes a second to put on because it's tight all right so you just uh just put the spigot in And on the other end, you just tighten the nut down. I'll come back when that's done. Uh, there you go. It's it's on there nice and tight. I actually just tested it to make sure it wasn't leaking. So did you ever see those Berkey water systems? This is pretty much the same thing, but DIY, and it's uh, on a budget. So what you do when you first use it, you want to purge this filter. So you just run water down into here, let it come out and get all filled up. Then you can just put it right over. And this pot will sit in like this. You can put the cover on top, let it filter through, and you'll have water coming out of there. I just, you know, I like the uh, whole DIY budget stuff, so... I did see this on another YouTuber, um, and uh, I like the way it came out, so I figured I'd do it. And it makes great gifts, too. Now, what I do it and uh, advise you to do is get a, a bit like this that's quality. To put the, uh, the hole on the spigot side was a little bit difficult because I think when I put the other hole in there, it kind of made this really dull. So you want to get a good quality... Um, Drill bit for that. 
But that's pretty much it. I will leave the link down in the bottom. Like I said, you get everything you need, all the washes, all the, 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 the uh, extra spigot, another filter, which will last for a thousand gallons. And I'm sure it'll last a little bit beyond that too. But, but yeah, there it goes, guys. So I hope you like that this video. Um, if you haven't already and you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. Give a thumbs up. And always remember, it's better to be prepared than for an accident to happen. And that was pretty stupid, right? <laughs> for the best, prepare for the worst. Till next time, guys. Bye.